Ceramic coating brand new cars and trucks is one of the most profitable services that you can offer in your detailing business and it's very economical on the customer as well. So guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for tuning in today. For today, I have this brand new 2024 GMC Denali Dually that is here for a full ceramic coating. This customer just bought the truck. It only has 35 miles on it and it came directly from the dealership and you want to know how I ceramic coated without paint correction? Keep watching the video and let's talk about it. So the first step in all my detailing is always washing the wheels. These wheels are brand new and the tires are brand new as well. You can see the dressing is still on them, but I am going to still go ahead and do a complete deep clean on the tires and the wheels because I want to make sure these wheels are absolutely clean before I ceramic coat them because if anything is on them or they are not cleaned properly, the ceramic coating will not stick. So for steps to properly prep the vehicle for ceramic coating is always to make sure wash the vehicle thoroughly and especially if this is a white truck I want to make sure that I wash really well and then after that I follow with the decon process that is first with the iron remover and then the second is with the claim it usually I wash the car or the truck and then as I'm washing each panels I do run my claim it all over the panels make sure to remove any kind of embedded dirt and then after that i will do an iron remover you can reverse these anytime you want but these steps are very important before you do ceramic coating now traditional way of doing ceramic coating is always to wash polish and then apply ceramic coating but in this detail we are going to do it differently After washing, I rinsed down the truck completely, but I did not realize my camera ran out of the battery. So here I'm drying the truck. Now whenever you dry a vehicle, make sure to always use drying aid. Or if you do not have a drying aid, make sure to damp that microfiber towel so you do not scratch the paint. And after this, I'm going straight to IPA wash, that is to spray IPA solution on each panel and wipe it down to make sure any kind of previous waxes or oils or anything like that that is on the panel is completely removed before ceramic coating.
Now you must be wondering, hey, you did not do paint correction, you're directly going to IPA wash and now you are ready to apply ceramic coating. Well in this case, that is true because we are not going to do paint correction. This is a brand new truck, it came directly from the dealership. Now this customer is going to use this truck on a farm, so this truck is going to go through a lot of works. It's going to go through mud, hay and whatnot on the farm, so the customer was completely okay with not doing paint correction. Now I offer this service in my detailing business for brand new cars and brand new trucks. So I do offer this service to my customers only if they have light color vehicles. So the swirl marks cannot be seen too much and above all the paint condition is in good standing. Now this paint was 95% good so we didn't have to do much paint correction because we're not going to get much out of it so here this truck is going to get fully ceramic coated i did follow all the steps except for paint correction now for a black car i do not offer the service because black cars need to be paint corrected before applying ceramic coating because black color shows everything if you are a detailer you can offer the service in your detailing business when your customers buy brand new cars they can get a ceramic coated without paint correction it is very economical on their side and it's profitable to you as well So if you stayed along with me in this video, make sure to check out this GMC Denali that I did a few weeks ago. And guys, this customer referred me to today's truck and they both are farmers and they both did the exact same thing. They brought their trucks directly from the dealership and I ceramic coated for them. So guys, make sure to tell your customers to tell about your business to other friends and family. And guys, if you are new to the channel and you really enjoy ceramic coating or you want to learn how to ceramic code make sure to like and subscribe and hit that bell icon so whenever you are on youtube you will be notified of my new videos coming along and if you have any questions comment down below and let me know and i will get back to you So as this is a brand new truck, I ceramic coated everything on the outside, that is the running boards, all the plastics, especially any places where you step on, especially these trucks have a lot of places where you can step. I did not ceramic coat them because I did not know that it would be unsafe or whatnot, but here in the tailgate jams i did ceramic coat it because the previous denali that i did the customer did go through a lot of mud and that was caked on mud everywhere in those crevices in the jams and all i did was take a pressure washer and wash it off that customer was super happy because i went just a little extra mile for the customer and this customer was happy as well because i ceramic coated the exhaust pipe as well and he was super happy about that so guys in your detailing business you can do that for your customers as well they will be satisfied and guys thanks for watching the video make sure to like and subscribe and just like always i will definitely see you on the next one make sure to watch the end result the truck looked amazing